Have you guys ever watched the movie involving the three Jonas Brothers and Demi Lovato? Because uh, it's called Camp Rock, which consists of eight letters, of which none are reused. Cut. Okay. <laughs> anyway, today we're going to find out what the rock in Camp Rock is all about. Would you say the movie is more rock or more camp? More rock, because camp is... Um, so, uh, this one feels a little different to the other ones because I think I've seen this movie before. I definitely know the song from Camp Rock 2, where they're like, There's too much at stake, this is serious. And based on that, there's a line in there where it goes, In our own backyard. So my prediction for this film is that they're like at this camp and there's two camps going up against each other on like who's better at rocking. One of the camps has the Jonas Brothers, one of the camps has Demi Lovato. Someone wins, I guess, summer camp, but they all look like 25. <laughs> <laughs> and I think Demi Lovato ends up with one of the Jonas Brothers too. Mitchie gets a chance to spend summer at a prestigious music camp. Okay, so there aren't two camps, just, just the one camp. Oh my God, title card immediately. <laughs> Oh, they do actually look quite young, you know? For some reason, I thought everyone in this film looked like 25. <laughs> I'm thinking of picturing what they look like a couple years after. They actually are teenagers. <laughs> it's, it's the fact she has just this like stereotypical Disney Channel bedroom. I feel like every Disney Channel character has this exact bedroom that's way too big, has way too many posters. Yeah. Oh, and she's a fan of the Jonas Brothers, guys. I just saw that post. I saw that. When he stormed off the set of the new Connect 3 video. That's their name, Connect 3. <laughs> Do you get it? Because... Can you imagine how easy Connect 4 would be if it was only three things you had to connect? Oh my god, that's the mum from Wizards of Waverly Place! They really just reuse all the actors, don't they? Oh yeah, they have, they have three actors and they're on um, replay. They're, they're going. That's like every Disney Channel show. They get a guest star and it's like a character from another show. With dad expanding the store and my catering business just taking off. DJ Khaled suffering from success. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. This is every plot as well. Just like, we don't have enough money except this big house in LA. <laughs> So, what are you going to do this summer? I love that. So what are you going to do this summer? Oh, yeah. Uh, so what's for dinner? Burgers. Well, our world famous tourist burgers. They can only make burgers because they make burgers at their job. They're chefs. I'm so confused. Um, You're going to Camp Rock. What? She's going to Camp Rock. Oh my god, that's almost like... That was what happens in the movie. Oh yeah, we were already just right there. See, now this is what some of the other Disney original movies could have learned from. They just cut straight to the action. We're already at the Yeah, top. how many? Oh my god, man just, man just did a flip! Oh yeah, I forgot, everyone's just showing up their talent. My man plays the drums and he shows that by hitting a bus rhythmically. This is so weird! <laughs> Why is no one saying anything? I don't know. <laughs> it's just pure silence. There are always people at camp, and it's just silence. Are you excited? A little. Okay, a lot. Yes, major. Yes, major. That took him five minutes to open that door. Yeah, she's just been sitting in the car. Yeah. Right? <laughs> she, the way she walked out, just like a main character as well. But she had to sit in the car for the big reveal. <laughs> Again, no one's talking. They're all just kind of standing around. There's a little bit of background noise this time. Sorry, I didn't, I didn't see you. Obviously. Remember, she's the one that got out of the limo, so she's the main character. The diva of Camp Rock. The diva, sorry. I want to say the word. Do you, do you know the word? Cool. That was her doing a remix. She's a DJ. Holla, holla, put your hands. This is so awkward. I, I hate this. <laughs> three years ago, we were campers. Yeah, man, this is where Connect Three connected. <laughs> are they like canonically brothers in this, or are they just friends? Oh, good question. What? So he's the diva, so he gets left behind by the brothers, which means they've only paid him enough to be in this movie. Are you gonna sing? A oh, mound of meat, that's disgusting. That's a lot of meat. <laughs> but you know, they, they make burgers. See, I missed that part. Yeah. They haven't mentioned it. 
Were they just sitting there waiting for him? No. <laughs> oh, and he just hides in a bush oh. and he's disappeared. I love the idea of him being like at a music camp, like, wow, she knows how to sing and play the piano. <laughs> This is Lola, Lola Mitchie. So, is this your first year? So quick. It's just yeah. like, Lola Mitchie. So, is this your first year? It's like, it's like she like just about remembered her line. It was like, I'm gonna forget it if I don't say it right now. <laughs> I said I've seen this before, but I do not remember any of this. I so, I might as well be going in blind here. Wow, I love your mom. Of course you do. That's a weird first thing to say to someone, to yes. be fair. Do you imagine like, hi I, Megan, I'm Seamus. I love your mom. But my mom. Uh, the president of Hot Tunes TV. Seamus, she just lied. Yeah. Can't believe it. She hasn't established to be a character like this, so where's this coming from? And I know I have to help in the kitchen, but I'll just get up earlier and meet you here. Sweetie, of course you can move into the cabin. It just, the line seems so quick. <laughs> it, it, maybe they took my advice too seriously. They're like, we don't want this to be two hours. So every time you've got to say something, basically interrupt the <laughs> sentence that you are responding to. It's like me talking to Vega, you know? Uh, yeah, well, it came from China. A little boutique called Jinjia G. Wow. What does that mean? She said that? Yeah, she sure did. Totally blingalicious. Oh, uh, what are these sayings? What are these sayings? This is real. This is me. I'm so confused by this. Can you imagine someone saying, do you have any songs? And then you just bust out like an acapella, like just sing the melody of the tune. <laughs> Can you imagine just approaching like an actual famous singer with like Germany songs? And then Taylor Swift just goes, yeah, do you want to hear one? And then she just goes, I knew you were trouble when you walked in. Your music, are you any good? I don't know. Uh... Maybe. This conversation is so awkward. Every conversation is awkward here. Oh, hey! Ooh, sorry. If someone did that to me, I don't think I'd ever talk to them again. <laughs> like, I, I, I actually, there is nothing I hate more than having water poured on me while I sleep. So you're gonna wake up tomorrow and I'm... I actually would kick you out. I'm not even joking. Done what before? You've never sang in front of an audience? Well, yeah. <laughs> There's nothing that I can do. You just sang in front of an audience. Like, Maybe a group would be better. If you're sure. I'm totally sure. Gaslight, gatekeep, girl boss. <laughs> this is the most cursed thing I've ever seen in my life. Can I just talk to whoever's in charge? Excuse me? Does she. She can't end up with him, right? She realizes he's a jerk, right? And there's a way to talk to a person, and that's not it. Oh, getting humbled. Oh my god, I hate this teacher. Do you see that? Why is no one like shocked that he's here? Or is maybe that what they're trying to say? He thinks he's like this this big man, but no one has actually really views him like that. I'm so confused at how little's going on. I know. But th there's been no talking between him and the rest of the camp. I was expecting there to be some big moment where he comes out and everyone's like, oh my god, Joe Jonas, Shane Gray is here. Talk about dancing to the beat of a different drum. The non-reaction to that. I want to know what it was like on set. Like, how awkward was this on set? Yeah. She's better once you get to know her. Yeah? And, um, have you? Have you gotten to know her? <laughs> have, have you gotten to know her? <laughs> <laughs> Poking my eyes out. Everything you say is so irrelevant. You know what? Okay. This is a moment for me because this song, I watched the behind the scenes of this movie and this is what inspired me to want to do filmmaking because this was filmed in the day. And this is what caused me sitting here right now. <laughs> Are we just get? Did you just say this scene from this movie is what inspired you to get into filmmaking? Yes. Let's pretend we're filming this at night. Wow, Vegard, how far have you come along? And also, plot twist, this actually is being filmed at night. <laughs> you don't think that song would sell? I don't know. She's so confident talking to this guy. Yeah, she I'm is, uh, so confused by this dynamic. Yeah. Also, why are they eating noodles with no soup? <laughs> it's just noodles. They're eating dry noodles. Look, it's settled. Look, it's settled. I gotta find you. To be fair, if someone just like got a guitar out and just sung to me, I would be so uncomfortable. Yeah, I would like, be. 
She's actually taking it quite well. No, that's like the worst guy trope. If a guy just brought out a guitar, oh god. Oh, god. Oh, yeah. This Maybe. is so awkward. <laughs> it's so uncomfortable. This is the most cringe movie I think I've ever seen. Right. Don't you think if you turned away and sighed really loud before walking away, someone would notice? Who has a better fringe, me or Demi Lovato? Uh, I'm gonna go with Demi on this one. Cut the cameras right now, <laughs> and we're gonna sell this without this. Oh, this is rich, but apparently you're not. Oh. So anyway, we're not. This is rich, but apparently you're not. Yeah, that was that was. <laughs> what, Caitlin? Nothing. Nothing. Baby, how many times have you seen this movie? Uh, I just guess. Green is Shane's favorite color. It was in the magazine. <laughs> Again, you have really met, hit the nail on the head with no one talking ever in this movie. Yeah, it's so weird. They just stand around. The only people who are billed for like talking roles are the main. But it's characters. like there's no even background chatter. How did she even do that? <laughs> Why is no one talking? She's really good. She's really good. <laughs> Except for the one person who's allowed to speak. Someone broke up with me like that once. It's so last Good time. Whatever major loser. I can't do it. No. What? Whatever major, major loser. loser. Whatever major loser. Because <laughs> yes. I wanted to look authentic next to my eighth note cupcakes. Oh, do they call them eight floats in America? That's so weird. That doesn't surprise me actually, but uh, America, you're weird. <laughs> oh my god, do they get along now? They get along now. My god, do you know we have a balloon too? This has been there for months. <laughs> <laughs> now I just find that girl with a voice. Oh, a, he's still good. looking for that girl. Shane Gray is looking for the girl with the voice. Oh, is this going to be like a Chinese whispers thing where they will lose track of the message as it gets through? <laughs> By the end, it's like, look for the golden goose up the beanstalk. <laughs> so this is a singing and music camp and no one can sing. The abs shop. Yeah, have, have, have the abs shop. I've thought about that. <laughs> really? Yeah. Why doesn't he ask her to sing then and just get this all sorted and done? I don't know. Problem solved, film cut. No, but 30 minutes off, I'd say. So we got, who's the canonically gay character in this movie? So far, none, but the DJ is definitely gay. I said none, and then I immediately had an example of someone who was. <laughs> I like your videos with gay friends. Oh, I know this song. I think you played this recently, though. Yep. This goes on way too long. It's like the most repetitive song. I think this is the fourth time they've sung the chorus. Tell us. She's a cook. A cook? Well, that's it. Get out of camp. You're a real jerk. And Shane is in the background. Yeah, I this love thing. that he's just standing there watching this go down. And all these people are meant to be massive fans of him, but they're more invested in this non-existent drama yeah. than the fact that a pop star they idolise is standing there. Like, can you imagine finding out I lied to someone about something and then being like, what, you lied to someone else? You don't have a popular mom. <laughs> I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now. She's gonna have to steal the song from her book. <laughs> oh, did you know? I'm so awful. <laughs> gonna let the light shine on me. <laughs> this is what I wrote for the High School Musical song when I sang it. How, how, how are you meant to know the tune based off words? And the last time I checked, no one was busting their butts to sit next to us at the lunch table. I just love the dynamic of this film. Like, Mum, you aren't cool enough to be my mum. <laughs> what is this? I do not get what they are. This is like, someone went to film stuff. school and made yeah. this. A lot of ketchup and mustard. Like, <laughs> how many people are they feeding? Is everyone having one card to eat? Would she have just like had her phone on silent for like a minute? I love that she like almost fell, and the crowd is like, <gasps> and then they're like, oh my god, she is so embarrassing now because she half fell off. She it. nearly hurt herself. That is humiliation. So, Done. Yeah. Your career's so over. So embarrassing. Oh, she said it slowly. Sorry. But I have this dream. 
right inside of me. Is she gonna turn around as she sings? <laughs> now this is real. This is real. <laughs> That's the song. That's the song. <laughs> A final jam this year is Margaret Dupree. Oh. Oh. That's it. That's the film. Yeah. That was the weirdest ending. I didn't see a scriptwriter. I don't think there's a scriptwriter in this film. Just a supervisor. I, I feel like they had all of the pieces in place for a successful movie. And they were just kind of like, this will work. Let's just set up some cameras and film. The biggest issue I had for it, just the absolute cringe of no one spoke to each other. No. There was so much just people sitting around in silence and just like... <laughs> to save Camp Rock, Mitchy challenges Camp Star to a final jam. You didn't This is what I predicted though. <laughs> I kind of predicted this at the start of the new movie. The, the first movie. Higher budget. Yeah, it is higher budget. You see that? It's a moving cam. Mom, obviously it's something. I mean, you and Subtle aren't very good friends. They know. I know you and Shane. Beckle, they know. <laughs> what don't we know? I mean, you update your status like every two seconds. <laughs> she uses Facebook. And I'm feeling good. Woo! I didn't realize they had zip lines Maybe at Camp Rock. What is with this shoulder movement? I don't <laughs> <laughs> They are gonna be with us for the entire summer. But I don't think that's the entire story. Ew, I hate this. I would have wished I was in the bus if, if my uncle yeah. had said that. What, you think I'm gonna drop it in the water? That's Frankie, that's Frankie uh, Jonas. Oh, the kid? Yeah. Oh, is he that young? We both have our niche. Niche? Do we have to root for... The nice. camp director guy. Uh, Are you finding out if he's British? He is born in London. Hey, pouty boy. Oh, I remember her from this movie. I, I think I have seen this before. Oh, wait, this is the song they sing that's like... It's probably why I remember it. I yeah. probably saw the song in videos on like Disney Channel at some point. Oh my god, do you get it? Camp Rock and Camp Star. Camp Rock Star. What if they call it Camp Star Rock? Or wouldn't it be Camp Camp Rock Star? <laughs> It's a good song already. This is the best song in all of the movies so far. Are you serious? The audio is so strange. Why is it? Yeah, why is it so quiet? Okay, I'm just like thinking of the dynamic here though. There are three actual pop stars at the other camp, whereas these guys are all like wannabes, right? So surely their camp is all automatically better than, right? Oh no, so she lost her bracelet and it landed on the boy she likes. Also, that flew so far. Do you see how big that stage is? My dad's Axel Turner. Mm -hmm. Her dad is Axel Turner. Okay, this is, uh, I'm gonna have to head out. Okay. Thank God's just like SpongeBob. I, I'm out. I'm giving you the fire. Oh, do, 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 no. It's a tough business. It's summer camp. <laughs> 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 we can't, we can't back down. We can't, we can't back down. Ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why are, you, are they like making these extras who can't talk do things? They draw the line. They draw the line. <laughs> <laughs> oh There's God. too much at stake. This is serious. Don't walk away. We can't pretend. What's going Are on? Are they gonna sing it again for him now so he well, gets the message across? Well, you said you needed some new counselors, so I found you some. But there were kids at the last one. Why do they need counselors that are the same age as the people at the camp? Well, you are going to have to buy tighter pants and learn how to play a tambourine. You're going to have to buy tighter pants and learn how to play a tambourine? What does that even mean? I don't get it. I don't get it either. Oh, he's spying on the... I think I've seen this film yeah. before. I'm remembering moments. Yeah. Maybe I've seen this one, not the first one. Because <laughs> I remember him, this relationship between this guy and the girl. I love that we've watched all these Disney sequels, uh, all these Disney Channel original movies for these videos. And the first one I remember seeing is, is Camp Rock, Rock 2. Too. Yesterday, I ordered 50 pounds of black beans and they delivered 50 cases of beach balls instead. That's can't eat beach balls. Oh, the Camp Rock Kitchen ordered beach balls. Yeah, let's send them that. <laughs> How far is he gonna canoe? Yeah, I know. I was thinking it's like he ran <laughs> and he's in a boat. Hey, man. Oh, what are you doing? Also, who sneaks up on someone with a boat? That's not possible. 
<laughs> accidentally sort of wrote your name on my hand, but used permanent ink. Wow. You know permanent ink comes off your hand, right? Is that like, I accidentally got your name tattooed on my hand, <laughs> which is really awkward, but it's not weird, right? I just... Little tattoo. <laughs> What's the plot of this film? I'm just like trying to think here. Like they've set up like this like Camp Rock versus Camp Star thing, and are they just gonna kind of like nothing happens when at the end of the film there's like a big like battle, like rap battle or something? Mm. <clears throat> oh, I've seen this before too. Can you imagine thinking you're showing up doing something cool doing this? Yeah, that's right. This is too, this is too much, Seamus. This is too much. Drums! A little guitar, please. A little guitar, please. I hope you're ready for the time of your life. Because we, because we, because we, when we, when we. Why is this the film I've seen? I don't know. <laughs> Buckle up, we're gonna take you for a ride. This is weirdly mixed as well. She, her voice is way too quiet. Is What's this an actual it? problem with the film or is it Disney Plus? I think it's Disney Plus, maybe. Do you think I should close it and try it? So I... Yeah, maybe, because this is so weird. Like, I'm just gonna use the raw audio there just to show everyone. Just like, like yeah. everyone, you've got to know that Disney... Imagine if it's just badly mixed on Disney Plus. We're gonna... Wait, sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry, we're gonna delay the video a second here. Um, <laughs> okay, this is... This is the revelation. Wait. So we... why did they mix it weirdly in the film? I don't know. We need to Google this. Campra two. <laughs> why has no one noticed this? Oh, wait. Music audio higher than vocal audio in songs. Disney Plus has altered the mixes of their movies. That is so weird. That's so weird. Yeah. Um. Also, I saw a spoiler. Hey, you you wouldn't be able to hear it if no. we didn't have subs. I wouldn't be able to hear it. No. They're like low, was, just a they're random like, flip. Every every film has some random person do a flip. I'd actually go as far to say I think the songs in this film are better than the first one. Yeah. It doesn't matter where. We just know that Camp Rock is gonna blow you guys away. Yeah. <laughs> they said it. Well, how about a worldwide audience? Yes, because the whole world is going to be watching a Camp Rock live rap battle. Hey guys, battle everyone TV. in the nation, turn up for this random camp in the, the nation, sleep. the world. I'm yeah. expecting people in Kenya watching this, <laughs> South Korea, everyone, everyone's watching this. I wrote this song a long time ago and I kind of forgot about it, but I think it could work. I think it's the ultimate bad sign for a song if you go, I wrote this a while ago and kind of forgot about it. <laughs> that, that doesn't sell me on the song, personally, you know, like... At the very least, Camp Rock could get some great exposure. He took advantage is what he did. I find it so weird they have these two have so many scenes together in this film. Yeah. Like, I'm just not invested enough in these two. Opportunity to destroy. Opportunity? Oh yes, I'm British, I don't pronounce my T's. <laughs> That's the thing that annoys me about it. From this moment on, everything is about winning the competition. My guess is they're gonna push it too hard and she's gonna be too focused on winning the competition. And she's gonna shaft her boyfriend to the side and be like, no, we gotta I, focus. I, yeah, I think they and then everyone's be gonna be upset with her because she's so focused. <laughs> <laughs> it's already happening. <laughs> yeah, right? And everyone's gonna be mad at her at the end because they're like, we just wanted to have fun, Michi. You guys have to work with me. This is so on the nose. It might as well be right here. Yeah. <laughs> that girl is taking the F-U-N out of summer. Oh, did you even said the line? <laughs> oh my God. They didn't I... directly say it, but they said it. Yeah. <laughs> What summer camp is all about. How could you? Because I'm that nice of a guy. Wait, thank God. I've just realized we're 40 minutes into the film, which means it's time for the main characters to break up. Oh. Well. I love he just comes home and is like, I'm gonna bash out a sad song about breaking up right here and now. <laughs> face to face, but we don't see eye to eye. Like fire and rain, fire and rain. Why are they singing like, oh, we're perfectly fine right now. We just, we wouldn't change anything. We have no time for each other and we hate each other. It's like you know. they wrote this song and they're like, yeah, it kind of yeah. works here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's look at the also harmony on measure 15. They just dropped in some music. That was a real, like, <laughs> they're gonna go for the alto harmony at measure 15. So them singing together changed everything. Yeah, I think everyone heard it. Everyone heard it. <laughs> <laughs> 
You did this? We all did. I was really ready for him to go, yeah, we're like Venus and Mars. <laughs> 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 we're not all rock stars. But you can be. <sighs> <laughs> I'm just gonna go, go be a rock star now. No, these songs are good though. This is also this, good. So it's good music in this one. Yeah. <laughs> What? It just went out. I just don't know what's going on. I don't know either. Do you think we can send a complaint to Disney? I don't use Twitter anymore. <laughs> if I had Twitter, I would tweet a complaint to Disney Plus. Yeah. Right I never wanted change and now they suddenly have time for each other, which I don't understand when this change happened. Because they wouldn't change a thing. Oh wait. <laughs> yeah. But I just don't know how to say I it. I don't know how to say it. You can sing it. You can sing it. Oh. <laughs> There's a lot of songs in this. Yeah. Like more than any other film. There's about a minute of dialogue song. Sometimes on a homemade quesadilla, otherwise it smells like food. What what's this song? I'm yours. I'm yours, yeah. This is I'm yours. Yeah. Do you think they wanted to make a third one where the third brother got a love interest too? But there wasn't enough interest? What is happening with these weird, like low quality shots? You can't be like us. Can't be like us. I love them saying, "You can't be like us. You can't be like us." It's like in Lemonade my Mouth when they all start singing, "Don't you wish you were us?" And you're like, "Okay, we get it." Yeah, I've seen Lemonade Mouth. Doesn't that? that I feel like everyone kind of like went, "What?" Is out of focus. I don't actually think I ever got this far in the movie. I don't remember this part. Does anyone remember this? In a, in a movie with some really good songs in there. They really ended it on a low there. Yeah, <laughs> I want to place a vote for Camp Star. Wow, well, real slow motion for once. Oh my god. Wait, why am I actually feeling this sad about this? I knew this, this got spoiled for me. Are they just... That's it. That, that's the comp done. Camp Rock is closed forever. It's a good way to end the series, in my opinion. Oh, we got the kids! I told you, it always happens in wow. film too. <laughs> I actually would say the musical numbers in that film as a whole were better than the first one. We didn't get to hear them in their best glory. <laughs> we did not. I put... The rock star in Camp Camp Rock Star. So in my journey to discover the best decom, today I failed. Camp Rock won. It was it, we we I genuinely don't know if it was had a script. I, wait, sorry. Um, Which? <laughs> I'm just saying if you look up script on the Wikipedia page, nothing comes up. I can't even really remember Camp Rock. Oh, there was another camp. Um, there was that cool guy, and Tess joins the other group. They don't really develop that side of the story at all. And you predicted like the whole like, oh yeah, Mitchie's gonna be like, yeah, everyone, let's get together and win this tournament. And then everyone's like, we're not having fun anymore. But in terms of my uh, decom ranking, ooh, I was about to say they're right at the bottom, but Descendants Free was. Bad. I, I think these both might be better than Descendants 3. Upon watching these films though, I've realized my true calling was to go to a music camp in the summer. Now, I'm finally going to live my dream. Special thank you to Kayla Chase, Christina Franzi, Jacob, Natalie, Natasha, Amanda, Aneshka, Jordan, Ollie, another Jacob, Jonathan, Ben, Victoria, Veronica, and Will for supporting me on Patreon. If you also want to check out my Patreon, make sure to check it out. Link in the description down below. And yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, you can subscribe, watch another video, and check out the Patreon I just mentioned in the description down below. I mean, that's it. I think that's everything. But I've got to leave this for like a couple more seconds just so like these end cards can stay up on the screen. Is that okay? I'm not talking to you, Vegard. I'm talking to the audience. Is that okay with you? What, what's he doing? What, what, 